and Malaysia is implementing a major shift in its fuel subsidy policy. Diesel prices in peninsular Malaysia will now be set at market rates, ending the government's blanket subsidy program. This reform is expected to save the government about $853 million annually. The high cost of subsidizing diesel, which reached 14.3 billion ringgit in 2023, is straining Malaysia's finances. Additionally, diesel smuggling across borders is a significant concern. The government believes these savings can be better directed towards development projects and social programs. However, the government acknowledges this change may cause hardship for certain groups. To address this, targeted cash assistance will be provided to over 30,000 individuals who rely on diesel vehicles. Additionally, subsidies will continue for essential sectors like logistics, public transportation and fisheries. This reform is part of a broader effort to improve Malaysia's fiscal health. The government aims to reduce the budget deficit by phasing out broad subsidies. The central bank is closely monitoring the potential inflationary impact of these changes. While inflation has been low recently, removing subsidies could push it up to 3.5% this year. For latest news, download the Vion app and subscribe to our YouTube channel.